This is a demonstration of key technologies in the XL4 time-sensitive network protocol stack. There are two key technologies that will be shown. First is GPTP. The Generalized Precision Time Protocol is the grandmaster clock that allows Ethernet to become a time-sensitive network. Second is FRER, Frame Replication and Elimination for Reliability. This is one of the key technologies for building a fully redundant TSN network. In our first demonstration, we have a configuration with two talkers and one listener. The first talker is the S32G evaluation board running the GHS Integrity operating system. The second talker is an Atom Minnow board running Linux. Both talkers will generate pulses and transmit them over Ethernet to the listener. The listener in this configuration is an x86-based PC running the Linux operating system. The listener will render for display the accumulation of pulses from each of the talkers. It should be noted there's no effort in this configuration to synchronize the generation of the displays. Ethernet is an asynchronous network and so delay will be indeterminate. As there is no master clock, the two devices will be generating pulses at their own pace and transmitting them over the network. When we implement GPTP, we will have a grandmaster clock and both devices will be generating and transmitting at a common pace. Here we see the system in operation. The S32G board is generating pulses that are displayed on the screen on the left. The Minnow board is generating pulses which are displayed on the screen on the right. The two are not in sync and we can see that the S32G board has established a substantial lead over the Minnow board. Over time this lead is growing. This is most easily observed by reference to the scrolling horizontal bar which gives us a visual indication of the accelerated pace of the S32G board versus the Minnow board. Now we have initiated GPTP and Ethernet is operating as a time sensitive network. The two devices came up independently but as they generate their pulses, they're generating at the same rate. We can see this as there is no expanding or contracting divergence between the counts on the two displays from the two devices. In our next demonstration, we will examine FRER, Frame Replication and Elimination for Reliability. This is a necessary technology for implementing redundant network links in Ethernet TSN. In our setup, we have a talker, which is a BeagleBone Blackboard operating the Linux operating system. This has a rotary device, which we will manually operate to generate signal, which will be transmitted over Ethernet via a switch to the listener, which is our S32G evaluation board running the Integrity operating system. The S32G will then calculate a speed in miles per hour, send this over CAN to a Raspberry Pi, which will render the speedometer for our display. FRER allows us to replicate the signal and timing at the switch so that the S32G board can receive two separate links with the information and can remain synchronized if either of those links is lost. Now let's take a look at that system in operation. As we manipulate the rotary, we can see that a speed is being calculated and rendered for us on the display. With basic Ethernet, this is coming over a single channel to the S32G board. If we lose the connection at port 1, then the information content is lost and we cannot render a speed on the display. With FRER implemented, the switch is now replicating that information and timing for us and sending it to two ports on the S32G. In this case, if the first port connection is lost, we continue to maintain the information on the display with the information from the second port.
The second port can be disconnected and we can generate the information from the first port. The information is fully replicated both in content and timing, so we have the ability to switch at will between the ports. It is only in the case of both port connections being lost that we lose the information and cannot render the speed. This concludes our demonstration of two key technologies GPTP and FRER from the XL4 TSN protocol stacks.